like water. From space, it is our planet's most striking feature. We find water everywhere that we find life. And this is no coincidence. For each drop of water has extraordinary properties that are essential for all living things. For example, North American redwood trees can grow to be over 100 meters tall. Water, carrying nutrients, must travel from the roots all the way up to the highest leaf. How does water overcome gravity to reach these great heights? To help answer this, notice what happens when a narrow glass tube is placed in a dish of water. Water begins to rise inside the tube. What causes this to happen? As we have considered, water is a polar molecule. That is, one side has a negative charge and the other side has a positive charge. As a result, water molecules form what are called hydrogen bonds with other polar molecules, including the glass molecules just above them in the sides of the tube. At the same time, the bonds between the water molecules pull the surface taut and draw up the molecules below, like links in a chain. These same forces, adhesion and cohesion, are at work in trees. Water rises inside the trunk of a tree via tiny capillaries, or tubes. Meanwhile, as water evaporates from the leaves, it creates an upward pull that is transmitted through the chain of water molecules below. Together, these forces lift the water, carrying vital nutrients to each limb, branch, twig, and leaf. All around us, this amazing process is quietly at work in plants, from the smallest wildflower to the tallest tree, which in turn provide food and oxygen for humans and animals. But perhaps our most direct and personal connection to water comes from its role within our own bodies. From the blood that circulates through our veins to the fluid around and inside our cells, water is the perfect medium for life. As a powerful solvent, water breaks down salts, minerals, and other nutrients, carrying these in solution to nourish our cells. As a chemical reactant, it is essential in the digestion of our food. Even proteins, the fundamental building blocks of our cells, have a special relationship with water. To function correctly, a protein must be folded into a specific three-dimensional shape. And this crucial folding process is guided by subtle interactions between the protein and water. Yes, in every way, the properties of water are precisely balanced to support life. Without water, our cells would be as dry and lifeless as a harbor in the middle of a desert. Instead, water energizes our cells, keeping us active, healthy, and alive. What an extraordinary creation water is and what a unique role it has been given in sustaining all living things on our beautiful planet Earth. On every level, from the tiniest molecules to the vast ocean spanning the globe, water is masterfully interwoven with the fabric of life. It is a powerful and daily testimony to our wise creator, Jehovah God, the one who made the heaven and the earth and sea and fountains of waters. <laughs>